Hello and welcome to another episode of Feed the Direwolf with me, the least of everyone, okay, Mr. Sorrett. Planted maybe a few too many of those trees. Um, okay, so I've got my quantum boots back. Just charging them up. By back I mean I crafted new ones. Um, we may run out. Huh. Well, for the time being, that'll do. I can't imagine we'll use up all that in one episode anyway. So I'll have to clean this up too. How are we going for you, you matter? Getting there. Getting there. I really do want to upgrade my quantum suit body armor so that I can fly around. Uh, that will need the quantum suit body armor. A HV transformer. Yeah, that's not terrible. Um, what else? Ultimate lap pack. Okay, that needs iridium plate and twelve iridium plate for one of those. Oops. Come on. And then that's another 12 for those. So, 12, 24, 48. Uh, what's that? 60, 70, odd. <laughs> uh, I'm just too tired. It's... it's... too much. Uh, what am I doing down here? Maybe I might just turn off my spawners again. Before we go into the Twilight Forest. See how they're going. Still haven't replaced, though, the missing steps there. Uh, I have not been in to collect... <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> There may be a few experience orbs in there needing to be collected. I've made this here so I can just jump down here. Let's collect them all. Whoa. Can't see. A whole lot of it just went into this one here. That was a lot of experience. Flying around me. Still a lot of experience in this jar. And quite a bit in this jar too, I'd imagine. I don't actually need it, it's just... Having it all sitting there was lagging or will end up lagging pretty bad, so... Let's turn these off. See how you're going. Pretty alright, I'd imagine. Not long come down and got a bit of experience from this guy, so I could make my Vile Sword. Wow. So much experience. Over here is looking pretty full. Let's just take those and put them in the chest upstairs. And these ones here, if you repair them, and then you put them in the uncrafting table. This is what the uncrafting table is for. It actually has three functions, but you can see for four levels, I can turn this into, if it was fully repaired, four gold nuggets, or gold ingots, sorry. Because it's damaged, I'd only get one out of it. Alternatively, I can put gold ingots into these three spots and fully repair it. I don't need it, so... <laughs> I don't need the gold either, but... We've got it now. Ooh. Did I not turn... Did I turn you back on? Oh. I'll turn you on. Well, you're off now. Lag on the way up this step. 
Oh no, he didn't. Oh well. Wow. Let's just whack that gold in there. I've been hunting uh, cows. Oop. Okay, now we may as well spend some of these levels. We'll grab a book and put a 30 enchant on that flame one. Not fantastic. You can put them together though and Oh, I don't quite have... I should have shown you the chain leggings, what you get for them in the uncrafting table. Once I've got a full set, I'll show you. Is there anything else I need to bring with me? Not really. Nope, nope. Alright. Let's go and... kill us a big... Oh, hang on map. Oh, there we go. We want to go sort of sort of that way, but not. Let's just head off in this direction for the time being. I'm sure we'll find the swamp. So we're going to go after the Hydra today. Hydra does reside in a swamp. Not just any swamp. He resides in a fire swamp, is it? Or a lava swamp? A swamp with lots of burny stuff in it, basically. Yes. So we're not going to be, be mistaking our destination. As long as we head in this rough direction, which would be much easier if I had the grav suit. Is the... Uh, Dark Tower, Oop, bottle of water, lapis block, what have we got here? Hedge maze. That was already on, yep that was already on the map so. Raven. Ah. <laughs> I've been babysitting, or not babysitting, looking after my son today. He's not quite ten months old, so I just caught myself humming one of the tunes to one of his toys. Uh. <laughs> yeah, if I if I start humming, it's uh, that's what it is. I think I've been doing it the last few episodes, actually. I'm gonna go. That way, and we want to eat a chicken. The running really does take it out of you. I didn't think that the chicken grinder would really come in all that handy, but it has. Oh. It really has. Oh, I thought they were the evil warg ones. Okay. Didn't want to load there. Running too fast. Okay, this here is a swamp. This is your normal swamp. I think. Yep. There's water. <laughs> Whoo! Oh wait. The Hydra bar has already popped up. Oh. There's the mound right there. Huh. There is a house over here I might just go investigate first off. And it's just a druid skeleton. Nothing too fancy. Oh, back over at the um, Dark Tower, I didn't collect it because I didn't have my scoop, but there are actually some water bees there. So I may end up collecting those and Giving those a little shot. I haven't used those before. Ooh, a key. Uh, do we have a... No, I was hoping for a sneaky entrance, but... No can do. Come on, have I got... Oh, yep. Hello. This is the Hydra. And 
Well, there's just one of his attacks. Weird fireball thingies. I think there's three attacks from memory. He has a bite attack. He has a flame attack and... Uh, what's the third one? An acid attack, maybe? It makes sense for the Hydra. He's only got three heads at the moment. That will chat. Whoa, hello. Oh, that's the explosion one, is it? Oh, that's what it is. Oh, you can shoot him back at him. Um, not acid, they're bombs. There you go. That wasn't very good. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Here we go. I'm nice and slow and I can't jump too much, but... Hello. Oh, and his head popped off. Being a Hydra though, you chop off one head and the second one will come back. Oh, wow. Yep, see, I got that inside his mouth and it blew up his mouth, so that's what you're trying to do. Now, you got the flame attack just there and the head that's come down just here, that head is actually trying to bite me. That's the bite attack. Oh, so what have we got? One, two, three, four, five heads now. So this should not be as easy as it is, of course. Mod's not meant to be. Well, it's part of the Die Wolf pack. It's not really. The Twilight Forest isn't really made with the. Um, I see two in mind, so... Oh! Done! This sword really is pretty damn good. Well, let's have a look at what we got. It's usually three things that these Hydras drop. We got all three. Okay, you got a Hydra Trophy. Well, that does nothing yet. Unless it's... No, nope, still doesn't look like it does anything. You have the uh, Fiery Blood, which is a crafting ingredient to make a Fiery Ingots. Fiery ing Ingots are... Uh, that's just a piece of iron, I believe. You can make your armour and weapons. Oh, and a pickaxe, I guess. Um, obviously, with them being fiery ingots, they're all going to have a f some kind of fire aspect. Fire aspect 2 for your sword, auto smelting for your pickaxe, fire aura for your armour. Very good. Yeah, what was the other thing? Oh, the Hydra Chop. They very nutritious and regen your health, I think, I believe. So, yeah, that's the Hydra. Uh, a little bit too easy, really. <laughs> I'll probably finish the episode a little bit earlier than I was hoping. Oh, that's... yep, that's the one that I want. This is the green route. You may just be able to make out the difference between the, the different routes. I'm going to try to make some armour using it, so, yep. That's the plan. You see the axe repairing itself there. Whilst I can't get my mouse working, whilst I'm right here, I may as well... Are we going in the right direction? can't really tell. Oh, there we go. Okay, now I've got a direction. Hmm. Well, I think I'm going to go and explore that maze, actually. It's probably not going to have anything terribly... What are you doing? Terribly exciting, isn't it? Ooh. Oh. Up 
But we may as well whilst we're on this side of the map. You see my axe there repairing itself. Every time it bobs down, that's when it repairs itself a little. Oh. Yep, we're on track. Doesn't do as much damage as the sword that I'm carrying, but the sword I'm carrying um, it takes damage quite quick. Would like to repair on it. I still have to make a new um, vile sword. What I want to do, and others have asked me to do it too, I want to see if I can't make an ultimate vile sword. So if you have an idea of what enchants you reckon I should try and get on there, let me know. Obviously it'll need soul stealer, that's the point of the vile sword. So anything else? Um, we can't make, we can't put all of the, the best enchants on, it's just not gonna, just not gonna work like that. It's just in front of me. Oh yeah, there it is. It'll end up too expensive if you do that. Okay, should we do this? Should we fall in a hole? Yes, yes we should, <laughs> apparently. Oh, hello. You're a green spider. And... A scally? And a zombie! I don't care. Oh, almost fell down another one. It's, it's kind of distracting the bobbing, but... Yeah. Oh, yay! Oh, wow. Well, uh, that had shears, mushroom, wheat. Hello. Did you follow me all the way from that cave? Don't really need any of that junk. All the shears. Might be their way of trying to get you to knock down the the hedge maze itself. Well, these ones are easy to to kill. They're one hit kill. You pretty much one hit them with anything. Oh, we have some melon, apple, string, more wood, arrows, and wheat. Oh, hello. There must be another spawner through this way. Oh, jeez. And there is. And a diamond, wow. Some mushrooms, some seeds, some feathers. Let's whack it on the ground. Wacky. I uh, don't have my digging bag anymore. We'll put all this down and see what we get and what goes into bags. Not much of it as it turns out. Another way out. Okay. Oh. Yep, thought that was the one that we'd already been to. No, 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 I'm not cheating. I'm not, I'm not jumping over. It just looks like I am. Just, just in, in case you thought I was. Yeah. Good bait. Uh, two chests. Well. More of the fireflies. Those I think we can pick up. In our bags, that is. A cobweb. Oh, Go away! Hmm. Stupid things. Hmm. Oh, yep, we had a second one, didn't we? Cactus, more feathers, some arrows, more pumpkin seeds, mushrooms, a stick, and a bow. So basically, a bunch of. Oh! 
Yep, we'll go. Right. See, we're going the right way. More stuff to fill up our semi sorting room. Hmm, yay. No. Oh, wait. And there must be one more chest over this way somewhere. Well, that doesn't have to be, but. What are there to be? It's not, I think. That's it, yeah, that's it. Well. Hmm. Just have a quick little look. Yeah. Not the longest episode, <laughs> but. Um. Well, we're done. I think what I might do is head on over to the labyrinth actually. Won't have time to do the labyrinth today. I've got a labyrinth on the map so let's go. And that will be next episode. Ooh. Oh wow. You guys would be very surprised if you could see anything right now because I can hardly see anything. Oh, well, yep, we want to fall there. We want to avoid falling there. Do -do, do -do. Oh. Listen to the toy just once and that's it. Okay, that was a, a lag fall. I blame lag. It was a big wolf. Yeah, come get me. Do do do. Oh. <sighs> Stupid toy. It's a piano. Piano that plays weird little tunes, and uh, as it turns out, drives me nuts. All right, I'm pretty sure I'm no longer on target. Hey, I may end up needing to kill a few of these um, sheep or ram in time. If I find the quest ram that is. Actually that might be something that I do off camera is run around looking for a quest ram. Not the most common... Oh, hang on. Oh, hello. I can't drown anymore, so... But I can do that. Hmm. Well, uh, that's the episode. <laughs> I... Uh, oops, stop the recording for a sec. I, um... Yeah, I'm gonna run back and... Oh, sweet! I had the, um... That chest lock thingamajiggy, so I keep some of my stuff. Oh, that makes it a lot easier to find my way back. But, uh... Yeah, next time I think I might fall down that cave wearing my quantum boots. If... No, no, actually I'm not going to. Chances are I'm get, that's the, the one item I'm going to lose. <sighs> so... Hmm. Sorry, just tabbing out there. Trying to see how long we've been so far. But doesn't want to tell me. Weird. Doesn't feel like too long, but then again, what do I know? I haven't slept for. Oh, it's coming out 24 hours. Wait, where? My death point. I go past it. 
Oh, yep. Yeah. Yes. Uh, we can do this. Alright, hopefully there's no lava down here. Uh, uh, some of these little burrs. Uh, sorry if you can't see anything. I don't think I have torches <laughs> just yet. Around here somewhere. Uh, oh no, I got them. Ah, uh, you go away. Alright, place a few torches down so. Oh, I want that. So you guys can see, and so I can see. Come on. Where on earth are we? What the... Creeper over there. Oop. Well, I think I've got everything. It's just... Oh, it's a spider up in the sky over there. Look like a flying horse. Well, I'm going to find my way out of here. Most likely back up through the well. And... Then I don't know. We're going to do something. Head over to Labyrinth and get ready for next episode, I guess. But hopefully you got something out of this episode. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, hit like, subscribe, leave a comment, and I will see you next episode. Bye-bye.